Hello my dear children welcome back to our maths class in the last lesson we have discussed some activities based on data collection today we are going to start 11th lesson beyond 10000 in this lesson we have to study formation of five digit numbers splitting of five digit numbers according to their place value etc let's start our today's class see the first activity how many How can we arrange 10000 in different ways children do you know how many 10000 is there in a 10000 yes one 10000 is there in a 10000 that is 1 into 10000 equals 10000 next how many thousands are there in a 10000 yes 10000s are there in a 10000 that is 10 into 1000 equals 10000 Next, how many hundreds are there in a ten thousand? Yes, hundred hundreds are there in a ten thousand. That is, hundred into hundred equals ten thousand. Next, how many tens are there in a ten thousand? Yes, thousand tens are there in a ten thousand. That is, thousand into ten equals ten thousand. Next, how many ones are there in a ten thousand? Yes. 10000 ones are there in a 10000 that is 10000 into 1 equals 10000 let's do the next activity bus math marudamala panchayat board five buses the incomes are as given below here we have to find out the income from each bus bus number 1 got 12000 rupee notes 300 rupee notes 8 10 rupee notes and 5 1 rupee notes let's find out the income from bus number 1 12000 rupee notes that is 12 into 1000 equals 12000 next 300 rupee notes 3 into 100 equals 300 next 8 10 rupee notes 8 into 10 equals 80 next 5 1 rupee notes that is 5 into 1 equals 5 then add these amounts together that is 12000 plus 300 plus 80 plus 5 which is equal to 12385 so the income from bus number 1 equals 12385 rupees next let's find out the income from bus number 2 bus number 2 got 10000 rupee notes and 8 1 rupee coins 10000 rupee notes that is 10 into 1000 equals 10000 next 8 1 rupee coins 8 into 1 equals 8 then add these amounts together that is 10000 plus 8 equals 10008 so the income from bus number 2 equals 10008 rupees next let's find out the income from bus number 3 Bus number 3 got 10000 rupee notes and 300 rupee notes 10000 rupee notes that is 10 into 1000 equals 10000 next 300 rupee notes 3 into 100 equals 300 then add these amounts together that is 10000 plus 300 equals 10300 so the income from bus number 3 equals 10300 rupees next let's find out the income from bus number 4 bus number 4 got 10000 rupee notes and 2 10 rupee notes 10000 rupee notes that is 10 into 1000 equals 10000 next 2 10 rupee notes 2 into 10 equals 20 then add these amounts together that is 10000 plus 20 equals 10020 so the income from bus number 4 equals 10020 rupees next let's find out the income from bus number 5 bus number 5 got 120 100 rupee notes 120 100 rupee notes that is 120 into 100 equals 12000 so the amount got from bus number 5 equals 12000 rupees children there are some textual activities for you based on this activity 
you should do this in your textbook see the next activity 10000s together the grama panchayat gave 10000 rupees to each of the farmer groups in the wards for growing vegetables the number of groups in each ward is given in the table below ward number 1 has 3 groups each group got 10000 rupees how much amount did 3 groups get to find out this 10000 is to be added 3 times together 3 times 10000 makes 30000 next ward 2 has 6 groups so the amount ward 2 got is 6 times 10000 equals 60000 next ward 3 has 7 groups so the amount ward 3 got is 7 times 10000 equals 70000 next ward 4 has 4 groups so the amount ward 4 got is 4 times 10000 equals 40000 next ward 5 has 2 groups so the amount ward 5 got is 2 times 10000 equals 20000 next ward 6 has 5 groups so the amount ward 6 got is 5 times 10000 equals 50000 next ward 7 has 8 groups so the amount ward 7 got is 8 times 10000 equals 80000 Next ward 8 has 9 groups. So the amount ward 8 got is 9 times 10000 equals 90000. Ward 9 has 10 groups. How much did they get? To find out this 10000 is to be added 10 times together. Which number do we get? How can we read this number? This number is to be read as 1 lakh. Children can you say how many 10000s are there in 1 lakh Yes 10 10000s are there in 1 lakh How many thousands are there in 1 lakh Yes 100000s are there in 1 lakh Next write the amounts the wards got in order from the lowest to the highest Which is the lowest amount here Yes 20000 So we can write 20000 at first Then thirty thousand, forty thousand, fifty thousand, sixty thousand, seventy thousand, eighty thousand, ninety thousand, and one lakh. I hope you all understood today's class very well. Today's class is over. Thank you.